and back to Pokemon White. So, first thing we're gonna do here is challenge this doctor dude, because it makes perfect sense to challenge a doctor. Just go, just beat up the doctor at your earliest, at your earliest convenience. Go ahead and do that, guys. Because it's fun to beat up doctors and make their life miserable. Because I'm a mean person like that. No, I'm not. I'm a very nice person, guys. Don't get me wrong. Mo's got Moxie, but he only has like one Pokemon, I think. So yeah, come on, Mo. You don't need to get that Moxie boost all the time. Of course, actually, yes, he does because it's his ability. But am I talking too fast? I'm sorry. I like to talk some days, and some days I don't like to talk. But most days I like to talk. So don't judge me. Crap, these guys have like, uh, they, they can't get hit by the little dig. I taught Mo Dig at the end of the last episode, and I want to use Dig on somebody, but this Tranquil does not want me to use Dig on it. Why are you a flying type, Tranquil? Why are you a flying type? I don't like it when you're a flying type. In fact, I just don't like fighting. Let's see if... I said flying types, I meant flying. I left up the L for some odd reason. Because I just woke up. But oh well. We're here to pwn trainers for no reason. Because that's just the way it works in the Pokemon world. God, people could see you and then they just want to battle you. I don't want to. What if I don't want to battle? It, but you got to avoid eye contact, so. Yeah, there's that. Just close your eyes in the Pokemon world. God, it would suck to live in the Pokemon world, because... Well, not all the time, but... When it comes to trainers, yeah, it would suck, because... You just gotta close your eyes if you don't want to... Sign so your trainers would be stumbling around. Oh, yeah, he missed his hypnosis. That's what you get. What is with all these people with one Pokemon? Mo wants more of a challenge because Mo gets that Moxie boost, but he can't use it because all these people only have one Pokemon. Oh, I should give that to Mo. But he's holding EXP share. In fact, Mo doesn't even need EXP share anymore. Let's give him the black glasses. Where are you, black glasses? Oh, there you are. Mo is already holding an EXP share. Would you like to switch the two items? Heck yeah. Who are you? You're the first person to come clear out here and talk to me. I'm so moved. So I'll give you this. Bro, stop crying. He's so moved. Stop crying, man. Put those tissues away. Cry, baby. You little jack wagon. Anybody get that reference there? The reference? Geico. 15 minutes to you could some more or in car insurance. Yes, yes. I would make a great person for commercials. Yes, I know. Well, I'm gonna need my little repel. Yes, there it is. Oh god, that's my last repel. Crap. Crap. There are two things I've learned about quicksand. You try to walk in the middle, you'll fall. Really? Didn't know that, Sherlock. And if you try to run through it, you'll fall. Really, now. My psychic type Pokemon just started making noises. Is it because you're in the ruins, or is it because of you? Ah, probably because of the ruins, boy. Oh my god, what is that? That is the weirdest looking thing ever. That better be special offense. Yes, great, you are so stupid because does Mo look like a special attacker? No, he does not. I expected that to do more because. No! But I expected that to do more because, you know. Stab, black glass is super effective, and it only did like a little more than half, but... <sighs> you killed my Mo! 
Junior doesn't like it when you kill Mo. Because Junior's like, whoa, 1,500 experience points. Yeah, Citrulith gives you a lot of experience points. You guys ever notice that Pokemon who don't evolve? I've noticed that over the years. That Pokemon that don't evolve give you more EXP for some odd reason. You guys don't believe me? Go beat up an Absol for no reason. I don't have any revives. That's just great. And I want to give Mo training here because there are only Psychic type Pokemon. And then there's a lot of Psychics there, so you know. And Mo is kind of the only one that can handle Psychic types. Great, my repel wore off. That's just great, guys. That's just great. <sighs> now I'm gonna have to go through that wild little. No. What did I say wild? No. I meant I'd go through this little castle thing, having a wild encounter every two steps. Oh, so far so good. Watch me jinx it. Dang, Mo. Mo is doing amazing, guys. Mo is an amazing beast. When does Mo evolve? It's like 27, 28, or 29. I think it's 29. But yeah. Or maybe 28. Yeah, it's either 28 or 29. I've been carrying two Pokemon fossils, but they're just so heavy. Uh, yeah, this clever fossil is... Tortuga, and this one down here is Archon. Its name escaped me for some odd reason. I'm obviously gonna choose Archon because it's the best ability in all of Pokemon. Just kidding, guys. I'm going with Tortuga. If you guys like Archon, there's something wrong with you guys. I'm so sorry, but Tortuga is just much better. Sturdy or Defeatist? I'll let you guys take your pick. Sturdy or Defeatist? Wow, we actually got through there without any wild encounters. These are little, uh, statue he he Daruma things. But yeah, seriously, guys. You actually want Pokemon with the ability to feed us? I mean, I know that, you know, Archeops has, like, superior attack and speed and everything. But think of Karakosa's little sturdy shell smash combination. I would much rather take that than some stupid defeatist thing, because... Archaeops is kind of frail. Oh, what am I going to do here? I'm going to go into Junior, because Junior can flame charge this little Cacnea ripoff. Oh, Junior can take that for days. Junior can take anything you throw at me for days. That critical hit wasn't even needed. Junior would have won anyway. Oh, Junior's almost level 30. That's gonna be great. My party is so overleveled. Ah. Uh, God, I trained too much. But, hey, you know? Hey, second dude. Mo has been looking forward to seeing you. The weird thing is that some of these second dudes actually have ghost type Pokemon like Yamask and stuff, so. Perfect example! Perfect example. You think psychics would always have psychic type Pokemon, but sometimes they mix it up. I mean, I remember back in like Pokemon Red and Blue, like when Ghastly Gengar and uh What's it called? It was like Ghastly Gengar and Haunter. They were like the only ghost type Pokemon, so all, ev all the psychics inside of Sabrina's gym would always have psychic type Pokemon. There were no, there's no of this ghost mess. I like ghost type Pokemon. I don't like it when psychics use ghost type Pokemon because it's messing with the original and the originality of 
Sabrina's epic gym with just psychic type Pokemon. Except some people, be, some of those people use Slowpoke. I don't think so. Slowpoke becomes psychic until it evolves. Uh, that up there. I don't know if you guys can see that. Can you guys see that up there? That item. Yeah, that item up there. That is TM26 Earthquake. And I obviously can't grab it. You need to uh, beat the main storyline to get that. But what is this? A hard scale, completely worthless. I want to finish Desert Resort in this one episode because I kind of don't like it. Let me put my little. Wait. Ah, there we go. That said, I don't have my thing registered. Alright. Ah, standing on an item. Hyper Potion, that's good. See, you guys should love me because I show you guys how to get hidden items, even though this game has been out for like a year. I still get you. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Ooh. We got something here. Ether, yes. This is the first Ether you find in the game. Oh, we got something over here, too. Oh, I'll get that. That's for like a Firestone or something. Dunamaka! 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 I do not want to battle you. As much as I love my party being over-leveled, I don't want to battle you. Oh, great! A ranger! That's just great. It's kind of weird because in the ranger games, the rangers are using their little spinny things to uh, befriend Pokemon, but in these games, they use Pokeballs, and in the ranger games, they're like, oh, Pokeballs, what is a Pokeball? And in this game, it seems like all they use is Pokeballs, so that's kind of weird. Don't ask me, guys. Game Freak is weird. Always has been, always will be. But hey, they make good games. Blitzel and Darumaka. Mo, that's just Mo's favorite combination there. Cause Mo can bone them both. I mean, it's kind of obvious. Come on, now, guys. And Mo is now going to level 28 here, and he evolves on the next level, not 28 but 29. Or does he evolve at 28? Well, I guess we'll see. Oh, crunch, that's a good sign. Maybe he will evolve. We're gonna forget bite, because we don't like bite. We like crunch now. Moe's not biting those potato chips anymore. He's crunching those potato chips. Yeah, Mo evolves next level. Okay. Sorry you got your hopes up, guys. I'm sorry I spoiled it. Ah, oh, great. Darumaka called it. No, it's not. Alright, Mo wants to destroy this thing because it murdered him once and he does not want to get murdered again. And Mo has to grow to level 29. So Mo, take this thing out in one hit, gain some EXP, and grow to level 29. I would love it if you could grow to level 29 before this episode was over. Ah, great. I need like a lucky egg or something. Ah, there we go. Why did I keep on walking? I knew it was going to be right there. Stardust, I can sell that. A ducklet, that's great. Am I gonna switch out? No. No, you guys probably thought that was like going to junior or something, but no, I'm not. Because I'm stupid. But you know what? I want to get to level 29 as fast as possible. Because that middle stage, that, that Crocorock, Crocorock is like the best stage of Sandile. Because Crocorock is like, he's got his arms crossed and he's got that clipboard and he's got his sunglasses and he's got his pencil. And he's just like, taking names. He's like, oh, 
You dissing me, son? You dissing me? I'll put your name. You know what? He, Croc Croc doesn't even have time to take your name, your full name. He can just write down your initials and be done with it. Just go case closed. Case closed. Wrote down your initials and I'm done. Rock Tomb. I should teach most Stone Age instead. Stone Age is amazing. What you guys should do, you should trade your Pokemon to your other games so they can uh, get TM moves. Like, I should trade Junior to my other White so he can learn Wild Charge by TM. And then Mo can learn Stone Edge by TM. And there's our rare candy here. How did I know? Because I played this game before. Psychic Dude, battle me and then this walkthrough will be over. I bet he probably had no idea what I was talking about. He's like, walkthrough? What? This guy would never go on YouTube. Probably spent 50 years of his life in a cave meditating. Even though he's out in the desert and he doesn't even look like he's 50. What is Snatch? I, I have never really understood the meaning of Snatch. Does it like steal your ability? Does it like... I don't know. Oh, I don't think Mo's gonna go 29 this episode, guys. I'm so sorry. Yeah, much like this Wubak is my boosted experience points for no reason. See you guys in the next Pokemon White version walkthrough.